Hi everybody, my name is Marie and on this channel I watch movies and series that I've never seen before. Today I'm gonna watch Airplane. I just want to tell you both good luck. We're all counting on you. Basically I have no clue what this movie is about. <laughs> Everyone's been telling me that it's super fun and I really felt like I want a fun movie today because I'm just in that kind of mood. I also think it's about an airplane. That's it. That's honestly what I know about this movie. What a great intro. <laughs> Anyway, so I also wanted to mention two other things that I got questions a lot about. The first thing is like, what is this? And the second thing is, where were your glasses gone and now they're suddenly back? They both have to do with the same thing. Normally, I don't respond to comments about my appearance because I think it's super irrelevant how a creator decides to look. But this one has to do with health and I think it might be important to educate people a little bit because I didn't know what was going on and maybe it can help someone else. Anyway, so I recently got diagnosed with diabetes. It kind of means that my pancreas has decided to leave working life and I kind of need to regulate my sugar levels on my own with insulin and sugar, of course. So yeah, basically what this is, it measures my blood sugar levels so I constantly can scan it gets gives alarms beeps that kind of stuff so i know like well, i need to get some more sugar because i'm low or when i'm too high i might drink a glass of water or use more insulin and so forth so it's basically yeah helping me be my own pancreas you know <laughs> second thing because my sugars were like so not stable i couldn't wear my glasses because it also influences your eyesight and my eyesight changed like every other week and i had like multiple different contacts over the past few months it was super annoying, it was super difficult, but my sugars are stable now, I'm all good, and the glasses are back and should be stable again too. So I switch it up again, contacts, I got used to it now, glasses, I always liked it, so here we are. You might see both from now on. I hope you like that a little bit, it's really weird for me to talk about, but I get these questions so often and I kind of think like it might help more info, you know, about how some people are doing might always be interesting, you know, might help in the future, who knows. Anyway, if you like this reaction, make sure to like and subscribe. And as always, full reactions you can find over on Patreon. There I post the full watch along style reactions to these reactions. Yeah, let's go! Theme from Jaws, a movie that I don't think I ever want to see. <laughs> Oh no, <laughs> plane. <laughs> Would you care to make a donation? No, but thank you anyway. I've been laughed at so hard because every time they stop me, I always like sign this charity subscription thing and then I feel bad and I never want to cancel it, but they're so... I cannot say no. <laughs> Don't ever stop me. Would you put all your metal objects into this dish, please? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's so funny. You want me to have an abortion? It's really the only sensible thing to do. <laughs> that type of movie with like all the dark humor that you cannot laugh at but you actually really need to laugh at oh no hey larry where's the forklift oh no no holy jesus <laughs> bad day at the job and i can't live with the man i don't respect yikes why does she not respect you, dude? What did you do? Whacking material? Oh my god, there's so many... <laughs> Modern sperm whacking material. She's scheduled for a heart transplant. Ah, Gus! Oh my god, I really need to get used to this. <laughs> In a reclined position, so that a continuous watch is kept on her IV. Okay. I'm going to start my life all over again. Excuse me, we'd like you to have this flower from the Church of Religious Conscience. Oh, I was gonna say, after a while, you would smack them in the face. <laughs> but I guess some people do. <laughs> I'd like one ticket to Chicago. Yeah, have a nice trip. <laughs> Striker, this is Red Leader 4. 
Oh no, trauma. See a bra to get that booty act. <laughs> Leg her down and smack him, yak him. Cold got to be. So confused with the different translations. Oh my god, it's too much English. <laughs> nervous? Yes. First time. No, I've been nervous lots of times. Oh. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> you feel all right, sir? I haven't flown for a long time. She just walks away. <laughs> She's not like trying to like. <laughs> you're in trouble. Okay, bye. <laughs> No wonder you're upset. She's lovely and a darling figure. Oh, pouting breasts, firm thighs. It's a shame you two don't get long. <laughs> I remember when we first met. Oh, here we go. Oh my God. <laughs> All together now. <laughs> <What is this? laughs> Don't do it. Me, I hope this hasn't been boring for you. <gasps> It's very nice of you, thank you. Cream? No, thank you. I take it black. Like my man. <laughs> of all things that I didn't expect them to see. I love you. Ah, the fish in the back. Ah. Seen a grown man naked? What? We better get back now, Joey. No, Joey. Oh no. He's gonna be remembering this even when he's like 30. <laughs> you like movies about gladiators? What, what's up with this guy? <laughs> I remember how you used to hold me, how I used to sit on your face and wriggle and. <laughs> I got a telegram from headquarters today. What is it? The big building where generals meet. Could I borrow your guitar? I thought maybe I could cheer her up. Oh, oh. oh what is complaining? Oh, you have a guitar. Mm -hmm. There is only one river. Assigned to an isolated tribe. <laughs> Supperware products are ideal for storing leftovers. <laughs> Is there anyone here who doesn't have Tupperware in their house? <laughs> anyone? <laughs> it's time for us to go back home to the plans we made before the war. Imagine if you speak to someone and they always talk like this. Wouldn't you think that's quite annoying after a while? And that, as much as anything else, led to my drinking problem. <laughs> you know, I know him too. She wanted a career. Oh, uh, her really? I don't know what is the word. Joey, have you ever been in a in a Turkish prison? I think the man sitting next to me is a doctor. That's right. <laughs> What the hell? He's a magician! This woman has to be gotten to a hospital. What is it? It's a big building with fish. That's not important right now. Oh no, so annoying. <laughs> How soon can you land? I can't tell. You can tell me I'm a doctor. No, I mean, I'm just not sure. But can't you take a guess? Not for another two hours. You can't take a guess for another two hours? No, no. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, a couple points of interest. We're now flying over Hoover Dam. 
And a little later on. <laughs> yes, of course. We both had fish. Oh, she ate fish too. <laughs> Can't even wait like a minute <laughs> for expression. Now we know what we're up against. Oh no. Just how serious is it? System causing severe muscle spasms, followed by the inevitable grueling. Ah, Gus. Oh, he's gonna save us, right? We're saved. How about some coffee, Johnny? No thanks. I want the weather on every one. <laughs> Go upstairs to the tower. Terry, check down the field for emergency equipment. Oh no. <laughs> so inconvenient for the job. Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit smoking. I feel like I'm still missing half of the references. 35,000 feet. No, wait, 34,000. Oh no. 33. <laughs> <laughs> Angus. He's smoking too. He does have a drinking problem. By the way, is there anyone on board who knows how to fly a plane? <laughs> <laughs> That got intense suddenly. Are you a pilot yourself? No, I'm in. He looks like such a good boy. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> the sound. <laughs> oh. So we had to take a special jeep up to the moon. Nobody's gonna survive the trip with him. There's been a little problem in the cockpit. What is it? It's a little room in the front of the plane where the pilots sit. That's not <gasps> You live another day, my man. Oh, you know, it was almost. Can you fly this plane and land it? Surely you can't be serious. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Why is the doctor investigating this? Like, as he, as if he knows. <laughs> Three hours later. <laughs> it's your wife. I want the kids in bed by nine. I want the dog fed, the yard watered, and the gate locked. And get a note to the milkman. No more cheese. Oh, okay. <laughs> Craig Flightly, you're up to a point. It's one of those men who, let's just say. <laughs> the background. <laughs> this is one particular mission. <laughs> oh, my. Mr. Stryker, this is the only hope we've got. Is this guy a famous actor? I've got to get out of here. Calm oh, down. Get a hold of yourself. Stewardess, please let me handle this. Calm down. Calm down. Now get back to your seat. I'll take care of this. Calm down. Calm down. Sister, please help me handle this. No, everyone. Oh, oh. I feel like after the gun, the bet's not necessary anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that must be so much fun to record that scene. All right, Steve, let's face a few facts. As you know, I flew with this man Stryker. A long time ago. What just happened? <laughs> we'll have to talk him right down to the ground. It's like I took the wrong week to quit drinking. I feel like he quit a lot in that week. <laughs> One hope is to build this man up. All the confidence I can. You ever flown a motor engine plane before? No, never. There's no way you can land this plane. <laughs> no! <laughs> Watch out you don't make any violent control movements like you did in the fighter plane. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not remind him of the past. It's <laughs> Quite intrusive automatic pilot. <laughs> There's no reason to panic. Oh. 
And keep an eye on that number three engine gauge over there. It's running a little hot. <laughs> Just hang loose, blood. She's gonna catch up on the rebound on the med sack. Is there another person in the bend? For Steve McCroskey thought you'd want to get down here right away. Why is there a horse in the bed? Is there a saying about cheating and horses? I feel like I'm on something. <laughs> and I'm sure I'm not. Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit amphetamines. <laughs> Please tell me that that's the last thing that he decided to quit this week. Who's flying the plane? One of the passengers. But he's an experienced Air Force pilot. That ice cream. Mm, I want ice cream. Let's get some pictures. <laughs> oh man, I feel like after this movie, like you're suddenly gonna take every thing literally and it's gonna be like in your head and you cannot say it because other people haven't seen this just right now. I've never been so scared. I'm 26 and I'm not married. We're going to make it. I've never been so scared. At least I have a husband. <laughs> I get every joke. <laughs> oh me! I forget every time. <laughs> the odds were against us up there, but we went in anyway. Captain made the right decision. The pilot's name was George Zip, and win just one for the zipper. Yeah, win just one for the zipper. Uh, <laughs> at least they're prepared for everything. Oh, 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 all right. Captain, uh, maybe we ought to turn on the searchlights now. It's just what they'll be expecting us to do. What? <laughs> I picked the wrong week. Quit sniffing blue. That's the last day. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Somebody like <laughs> <laughs> Body push the plane now. Just want to tell you both good luck. We're all counting on you. <laughs> Professional. Oh, yay! Good job, Ted! You got the girl! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Goodbye! Ah! He suddenly grew an eyelid. Oh, it's done! Man, that was unique, I would say. What's that genre called? Is it slapstick? I feel like I've said a million stupid things today, so I feel like one more is not bad. <laughs> I had a good time. This was a really good movie to watch tonight. Man, I still, I kind of want to like read up on it and check all the jokes or like watch it again now with like after Googling stuff because I feel like I got like half the jokes, but I feel like there's also so many that i just don't know 
So let me know if you notice that I missed some. Which ones? Man. <laughs> it's so absurd. It's so absurd. That's a good word for it. Damn. I, yeah, I had a lot of fun. I feel like there's nothing more to say. <laughs> great story. Great acting. Great producing. <laughs> I hope you like these reactions. Let me know what you thought about this movie. Was this humor that you liked? Did you enjoy watching it? Or do you rewatch it sometimes too? Let me know. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. And as always, the full reaction is for you available to watch along with me together on Patreon. I wish you a lovely day and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>